Hello, welcome back to my channel. I am looking not as well lit as I usually do when you see me in my YouTube videos. Today's video is gonna be a little more casual than that. This is my, I'm here with my morning hair. I know you guys love to see me like this, looking crazy. Edges not laid, do you see that? This is what I have to work with most of the time. But today's video is just gonna be a casual day in my life vlog style video and it is brought to you by Ula Henriksen, not to be confused with Ul, Ulala, Ule, Ule Herenskin. It's Ula Henriksen. I know a lot of people get the name wrong. I think I did when I first started using them, when I first discovered their products. I'm gonna be showing you guys some of the new Ula Henriksen products that I have right here. So here we are. I'm gonna go tame this. I need coffee immediately. Immediately. I just washed my hair. I gotta smooth it out now. Oof. You know those nights where you sleep on your neck weird and you just... Uh. Once I have my coffee, all my problems will be solved. Facts. Facts. So usually at home, I just do a tiny three second splash of this creamer. I'm very particular. One, two, three. Boom. That's it. Oh, this is the best part of the day. Do you like that sound? That is the best sound ever. The best part of waking up is folder than a Yes. A lot of people have been asking about my extensions. So these are great lengths, individual extensions. They stay in my hair for, I don't know, I think about three months. This is the first time I've had these extensions, so I can't really tell you much about them. I think that if you get them done by the right person, the right way, they're not gonna damage your hair, but I'm pretty sure there's probably people out there getting their hair damaged, you know, from an experienced extension hairstylist, I don't know. So, so far, I love them because it has made my life so much easier getting ready. I brush it out, I usually put some leave-in conditioner. It's just like the way one. These ones in particular dry a little bit curly, so it's nice because my hair's curly. All right, we're gonna fix this hair. I'm gonna do a time lapse of this. All right, my hair is smoothed out, blow dried, no more crazy morning hair, fresh start. Orale pues, now my hair is smoothed out. I'm gonna apply some serum to get my skin nice and prepped for my makeup that I'm about to apply. I'm using a new product from Ula Hendrickson. It's the Glow Cycle Power Serum. What's good about this serum is it actually uses a plant-based alternative to retinol because we all know retinol can have some weird effects and it has all the benefits without having all the disadvantages of retinol. Retinol is good for wrinkles, fine lines, dark spots, all the bad stuff that we don't want because I don't want wrinkles, okay? I don't want fine lines. I don't want to age great. I don't really just, I don't want wrinkles, okay? If I can prevent them, I don't want them. And the one thing I definitely don't want and I struggle with is hyperpigmentation dark spots, okay? If I get a breakout, I have a dark spot for ever. Sometimes I don't get them, sometimes I do, and they'll be there for months. I actually just got complimented when I got my makeup done the other day by Glam Tech Steven. He said that my dark spots are almost all gone. And they actually sent this out to us two months prior to launch so that we could test it out, see if you know, it works for us. This is what you use during the day. The one I used at night was this cream. This is the Ula Hendrickson Goodnight Glow Sleeping Cream. Okay, this stuff smells like lemonade. So during the day, you wanna apply this serum and I always pat serums into my skin. It smells so good. It almost smells like it's creamsicle. So I just pat it into my skin. I think we're pretty good. Now we're gonna go do our makeup. I'm gonna be filming a video today. This is what I do when I go get ready to film. Ah, my coffee! Don't spill it. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, we're good. Daddy. What? Yeah. See? See what it's like having siblings? You don't want them, okay? <laughs> They're awful. <laughs> <laughs> I'm walking over to my studio. I have my iPad is key. I always bring my iPad with me everywhere when I film, get ready. Marky, if you're in the background, you're gonna be in my vlog. <laughs> here we are. Boom. We got Sven over here. I think he hates me this morning. Why would I hate you? I only got you oh my god. And we got Cindy trying to force feed me vitamins. Listen to me. I don't even know what I'm taking. They could be poisoning me. It's good for you. They, they, I wouldn't put it past them. 
Usually I come in here, we already have the backdrop set up. This really pretty peachy with a spotlight. Just gotta get my hair stuff ready because I'm about to shoot a hair video. Um, and then I'm gonna do my makeup off camera because I'm not doing a makeup tutorial and so I always have my iPad with me. I literally carry this thing, it's attached to my hip. I am obsessed with the iPad. I could be in front of a giant big screen TV and I'll still be watching things on my iPad. I just love it. I take it with me everywhere. This is like one of the best things I've ever gotten. Thank you. Esteban. I have my coffee, my iPad. Right now I'm watching Hands of God. It's kind of a kind of like a weird show. Like it makes you feel weird, you know? But now I'm really in deep into it. At first I was like, what am I watching? Because there's a lot of like sex scenes and when there's people in the house and you're, you know when a sex scene comes on and there's people in the house, you're kind of just like, you know, but that's kind of all done now and it's just all really twisted and crazy. So I'm gonna be getting ready to film now, so I'm gonna turn this off and then I'll see you when I'm done. All right, guys, I finished filming my hair tutorial. Easy waves. I changed it to the stress. This is from Windsor. I'm about to have a little barbecue with my family. We got some pico de gallo. My dad thinks he's the best at making this, so. Uh, there's no thought about it. <laughs> Arroz, frijoles, we have carne asada outside. Got some beer and wine. How's it? Perfect now. Marty and I, we, we got it down. We have the right formula. The men are cooking. And we're sitting and enjoying our drinks. Wine. So, that's I don't because, know. That's because the men like their food. Oh, what are you trying to say? Not, not <laughs> what? <laughs> they like good food. No. They we like good food. We let you think that. It's yeah. fine. Her and I do things bad on purpose so that you guys will do them. That's the trick. You didn't know? <laughs> uh, yeah, that's it. If I didn't know you both, then you know, I might buy that. But since I know you both very well, I never have to worry about a challenge in the kitchen. <laughs> Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Little do they know, Marty. We got some food going, yes. Carne asada. Those are my favorite onions. We need to grow those in the garden, honey. Your face is actually the same color as the meat right now. <laughs> On camera, especially. You look especially sunburnt today. Thanks for white balance, But you still, look, you still look very handsome, though. Oh, thanks, Just I appreciate that. My little lobster. Getting some water. I usually water my plants closer to the evening time so that the sun doesn't burn the leaves. They can stay hydrated all night. Ugh. Gotta get my climbers. Awesome. How many outfit changes have you had in this vlog? It's hard to say. You know, I film in my sweats, so not many. This one needs more water than that one. Did you see that hose I sent you? I slid into your DMs? No, I didn't see it. I sent you a this is why I don't send you DMs. Check your DMs. It was code for, honey, get me this hose. Setting up all the accoutrements. I ate all the pico already. My dad brought some bamboo so that we could tie the flowers up so they start to climb. We just finished eating them stuffed. Are you stuffed, honey? Um, we had a successful barbecue. Now I'm just getting ready for bed. I made myself a hot tea because I've been coughing a lot for like the last two months. I just removed my makeup and now I'm using the Ula Henriksen toner. This actually, surprisingly, you think your makeup's all off and then I put the toner on these like little pads and then I see this and I'm like, damn, I was wrong. So I always give my face a nice pass over with this. Now I'm gonna apply the Ula Henriksen Goodnight Glow and this is the sleeping cream. So this is gonna make it so that when you wake up your skin looks nice and glowy. It's kind of a lot, but I'm the type of person that whatever it says to put on, I up it a notch, you know? Dime size, you say? No, I'm gonna take it to the nickel size, okay? It smells so good. Upward strokes, up the neck as well. Don't forget your neck and decollete because that part ages just as much. Actually, the neck, I feel like, ages a little bit more. This product also helps with fine lines and wrinkles. It helps to like resurface your skin. It helps with the skin texture. It also helps exfoliate the skin as well. 
it smells so good. All their products smell amazing. And then at the end, I just kind of like give it a nice little pat. I really make sure to put this on my neck because this product helps with the elasticity of your skin, which I feel like I don't have a lot of that on my neck. I mean, I don't feel like a lot of people do. So I'm like, make sure to get it on there. Steven, you want some? Want to hit this or what? What do I do? Are you serious? It's moisturizer, you just put it on. You should take a dime size. I'm the only nickel size like, love around here. <laughs> Steven, you're like a burnt sausage right now, so you really need to like, like also you put it on your neck like this. No, 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 up upwards. They don't know anything, man, over here. <laughs> upward strokes, upward strokes. You never oh. want to pull down on your face. Everything, always, you take it up. Gravity is already pulling down. We're taking it up. Can I put it in the hair, too? No. Or? I can't with those arms. That's pretty good. That's good. Let me get my eye cream. That smells good. It smells like lemonade. Also, when you put eye cream on, you make sure to pat and use this finger, your ring finger. It's the most delicate finger to apply the under eye cream. I'm still wearing my daytime outfit here. I'm about to take it off and put my jammies on. You know, I don't really wear a lot of cute pajamas. I'm more of like a whatever t-shirt is the most comfy. These are my pajamas, very fancy. This is like a really comfortable shirt. You probably see me wear it on IG stories all the time. All right, so now, usually I just brush out my inches before bed, because they tend to get a little tangly. And then I take it up a notch and get real sexy, okay? Steven loves this part. So I like take my hair, we're gonna wrap it up, because I don't want all these inches in my way when I'm sleeping. Then I get my bonnet. <laughs> She has arrived. You can't handle all of this, okay? <laughs> all right guys, that is it. I'm ready for bed, I'm gonna go to sleep. Actually, I'm probably gonna watch Netflix for like an hour and then fall asleep. I hope you enjoyed my little mini vlog today. Big shout out to Ula Henriksen for sponsoring this video. And I will see you guys in my next video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. Thank you so much. Good night, good day. Let me get my regular camera. It's my phone. Ugh. I'm using like a jar of peanuts to hold my camera up. Ah! It's not really working. You good? Boom! That looks good. She's professional, ladies and gentlemen. You don't need no man. I don't need no man. Maybe I should get my face in frame. So 